This is what we have so far. We are going to sew through all these beads. We are going to sew through the second hole. And we are going to grab 15 all, three 11 alls, and a 15 all. So through the same hole. We are going to sew up through the diamond dual hole. And it's just like the previous steps that we've been doing. We are going to sew through all these beads until we get to this bead. And we are going to repeat this step throughout the row. Okay, so this is the way our ornament looks so far. We are going to sew through the 15 and 3 11s to position our thread in the center of this um, little pickup shape. So this is what I'm going to do. So we are going to continue all the way around and I'll be right back to show you how are we going to finish our ornament. I finished the row and I started a new row, but um, like I say, I'm designing this uh, ornament as I'm going. I really like this, so I'm gonna keep going for you to see what I'm working and then we decide. But I really like it like this. It's gonna look cool. This is what I have and I really like it. It's gonna look pretty. I'm going to sew through the diamond dude. And um, when I do it on the other one, we'll be able to see. I'm just trying to decide on which way I like it more. And I added more thread. So if you have issues adding thread, um, you can give me a message and I can make a video on how to add thread. The thread is exiting from the top hole. We're going to sew from the bottom hole. We are going to pick up 115 all. 311 O's and 150 O. Our thread is exiting from this hole. We are going to sew through the same hole in a reverse direction. Yes. We are going to sew through the 15 and through 211. We are going to pick up 111, 115, one diamond duo, pick up a 15. And add 11 
and we are going to sew through this 11. A thread is succeeding for this center bead. We are going to sew down to the 11 and to the 15. Through the diamond duo. Through the 15 and through the 11. We are going to pick up 115 O and we are going to sew through the 11 and the 15. We are going to sew through the diamond duo. Sew down through the 15 and the 11. Pick up one 15 O. Sew through the 11 and the 15. Sew through the diamond duo. And sew back through the second hole of the diamond duo. Cut 115, 3 11s and 115 and sew through the diamond duo. Come down through the 15 and through the 11. Sew through the 11. Pick up an 11. 15, diamond duo, 15, and an 11. Our thread is exiting from the 11. We are going to sew back through the same 11. Sew down through the 11 and the 15. Sew through the diamond duo. And as if you notice, this time I put the um, diamond duo backwards because I like how shiny it is on that side. So through the 15 and the 11. Pick up a 15. So through the 11 and the 15. So through the diamond duo. So through the 15 and the 11. Pick up a 15. So through the 11 and the 15. And so through the diamond duo. Pick up a 15, an 11, a tear drop, an 11 and a 15. And we are going to sew through the same hole of the diamond duo. And there you have it. We are going to repeat these steps on this side. We are going to sew down through the 15, the 11, the teardrop, the 11 and the 15 one more time to reinforce. And also we are going to work our way through the next diamond duo so we can continue working.
we made it to the next diamond duo. So we are going to pick up 115, 311 and 115. We are going to bring them down and we are going to sew through the same hole of the diamond duo. We are going to sew down through the 15, the 11, and one more 11. Pick up one 11, one 15, one diamond duo, one 15, and one 11. And we are going to sew through the same bead we are exiting from. We are going to come down through the 11 and the 15. So through the diamond duo, So up through the 15 and the 11. As you can see from here, all the steps are repetitive. So I'm sure you can figure it out on your own. You can rewind the video to see the difference. Pick up a 15, so through the 11 and the 15. So through the diamond duo. So through the 15 and the 11, pick up a 15 and so through the 11 and the 15 and continue repeating the same steps until you finish your ornament. And there you have it. I'm very happy with the result. So you're just gonna continue all the way around and you'll be done with your ornament. So I'm gonna keep going.
and if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe give me a like leave me comments let me know what you think about this ornament and we'll see you on the next video thank you